Hello, you five, and welcome back to some more maths. So we've finished with the statistics now from last week, and now we're going to start looking at 3D shapes uh, in particular. So we've done a lot of work this year so far, already on 2D shapes, finding the area, the perimeter. We have done a little bit of work on 3D shape, finding the volume. Um, today we're going to look at 3D shapes in a bit more, just to get the properties of them. Um, and then through the next couple of days, we will continue to do some more 3D shape work. So I have here a couple of 3D shapes. Um, and I'm going to look at this one, this one, I'm going to look at the cube. Now, for, three, to, for today's lesson, you're going to be looking at 3D shapes, uh, pictures. Um, if you have, excuse me, if you have some of these 3D shapes at home, objects at home, Great, you can use them to help you. If you don't, that's fine because there's going to be pictures on the work. So you just have to look very carefully at the pictures. And what you're going to be doing is you're going to be looking to find three facts about the 3D shapes, um, which are finding the edges, the faces and the vertexes. So let's first of all just recap on what those things are. So most 3D shapes have got little points, little corners. They are vertexes. So the corner of a 3D shape is called a vertex. So this is my cube, and it's got a corner one, two, three, four corners. And so it's four on that side, five, six, seven, eight. So it's got eight vertexes on the cube. Now, the second thing that we will be looking for is edges. So the edges are the lines that go along. OK, so you'll have to work out, you'll have to count the lines of the shapes. And the next thing we're looking at are faces. So that's the sides of the 3D shape. So like I say, if you have got some of the 3D shapes which are on the work today, um, fantastic. You can use them like this visually to help you. If you haven't, do your best, look very closely at the shape to get the vertexes, our corners, the edges, which are the, the lines, and the faces of the 3D shapes. So that's what you're going to do today. Best of luck. Myself and Miss Lovell will look forward to looking at your work once you've completed it. And fingers crossed, you'll do a good job, which I'm sure you will. Take care.